Hey guys, what's going on? Steven back again, and I'm here with another Star Wars Battlefront 2 video. So it seems like we are not getting a season pass for Star Wars Battlefront 2. Uh, if you remember the first season for the first game, the season pass was I think either fifty or sixty dollars, which was pretty expensive. I mean, that's basically the cost of a new game. So um, yeah, according to Comic Book, uh, EA is making a lot of changes for Star Wars Battlefront 2. This time around we're getting a full single player campaign and it seems the publisher is also abandoning uh, the season pass model. Uh, this is what the creative director, um, I'm not even going to try to say his name, uh, had to say about DLC plans. Uh, we don't have a season pass, we decided on that, and it's one of those difficult decisions because it had so many implications all around. When we looked at the way Battlefront had evolved over its lifetime uh, with the DLC and everything, we decided, you know what, for this type of game, season passes are not the best thing. We don't want to segment our community, I cannot talk about the specifics of this, but we have something different in mind that will allow you to play longer, be more invested in the game without having a fragmented community. We need to come up with something better. So that's what he had to say about season passes and, um, you know, future DLC. Uh, but the article goes on. Of course, Star Wars Battlefront 2 not having a season pass doesn't necessarily mean the game's DLC will be free. There's a chance EA will simply make players buy expansions individually. But I wouldn't count on that. It's much more likely Battlefront 2 will follow in the footsteps of games like Titanfall 2, uh, Splatoon and For Honor and offer major DLC for free while trying to make money from optional microtransactions. EA has confirmed uh, the game will character customizations so there will be a lot of trinkets on sale. So I guess that is what I guess they're going for. Maybe uh, Apparently microtransactions are going to be the way, but I guess, you know, don't expect, you know, if anything, if any of this stuff is really fully confirmed, um, you know, I guess, um, you know, expect um, microtransactions, uh, little trinkets on sale, so probably different customization items and stuff like that, maybe different helmets, maybe different variations of helmets or something like that. Um, you know, different, I don't know, different color weapons, I, I don't know, but, uh, yeah, it will be interesting to see what they do about this, I mean, I can't really see them offering major DLC for free, but that's just me, I mean, I can see them maybe tossing out, like, a map here and there for free, or a map and a hero for free, um, but yeah, major DLC, I I don't know, I really can't see them, you know, giving that away for free, but, you know, I guess we'll have to uh, wait and see, I don't know, maybe I guess they're expecting to make a good amount of money from whatever these microtransactions are going to be, and these, uh, lots, lots of trinkets on sale, um, I don't know, I guess we'll have to, uh, wait and see but um yeah let me know what you guys think are you happy there's no season pass no you know you don't have to pay an extra 50 or 60 bucks for you know season pass uh, yeah let me know what you guys think uh how would you like to see their dlc's you know go would you like to see them from you know would you like to see them for free or do you think they'll give them away for free do you think they'll give some away for free make uh make you pay for some of them and what do you think about these microtransactions you know, uh, let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. And, um, yeah, if you like this video, feel free to hit that thumbs up button. That'd be awesome. And if you like the channel, feel free to hit that subscribe button. I'd like to say thank you to all my new subscribers. Uh, it means a lot. And, um, yeah, feel free to go check out some of my other videos. Uh, if you want to follow me on social media, my links will be in the description box below. And, um, yeah. And that is all the news we got on uh, Battlefront 2 for right now. I'm sure more will be coming out soon. 
you know, E3 is not uh, too far away. I think, what, less than less than two months, a month and a half maybe at the most. Um, so I'm sure we'll definitely hear more then. So other than that, um, yeah, more videos are on the way. So I will see you guys next time.